Cosplay World. Today we're going to talk about using our uh, brushes or painting in general with PVC foam sheeting. Uh, it's a good material to sand up before we start painting because it's uh, pretty slick and we don't want the paint chipping off. Priming is also useful too if you have one, a primer for plastics. Now, um, PVC foam sheeting actually comes in a variety of colors, so if you want to start off with, say, red or yellow to uh, begin working, that will definitely help with the base coating of your work. But because this is a gradient, uh, that's not going to help us too much, so might as well use white and paint over it anyway, because it's uh, you're never going to find this specific color, that's for sure. <laughs> Now, uh, edge brushes in particular are pretty good about getting into and underneath a lot of details because it's a more precise brush. Uh, you may want to get yourself a set of specifically edge brushes where you can get down to the uh, three, uh, sorry, three millimeter wide brushes. Uh, this is because uh, a lot of the uh, PVC you're going to buy is going to be th three millimeters thick or one eighth of an inch thick, and if you have layers. Uh, and especially if those layers are different colors, uh, getting nice clean edges is going to take a lot of time. We don't want a sloppy brush uh, messing up those clean lines and having to do more work and going it over and over and over again. So I absolutely use my finer tip uh, edge brushes with PVC sheeting just to make sure that that raised or thick uh, material there when we have two uh, layers over each other has a good clean finish rather than kind of a blotchy uneven line there. I hope it helps you. Hope to save you some time on your paint job. Good times to all. Hurrah! Listen, I got cosplay tutorials, con coverage, and general cosplay fun. Why don't you stick around a bit?